arrived. We have finally made it. Welcome to this ski vlog. Now, I think we all underestimated how big of a journey it was going to be. So we arrived in Geneva yesterday, probably around half two. And it's about a three hour car transfer. So all of us crammed all of our cases, all of our stuff into the car. Yeah, and it was a good three hour drive. And then we arrived in our chalet. It's so cute. And we've got two hosts that are looking after us for the week. Um, who are amazing and they've managed to make us breakfast and dinner and it's yeah I feel really treated but we're on a bit of a time crunch just now because we're gonna try and get out on the slopes for the first time to say I'm nervous is an understatement I'm pooping myself obviously I've done one lesson so that's all of the expertise I have and there's about a group of I think there's eight of us um, and we all range from different like me and Adam are complete beginners some of them are like pros so we might see very last minute if there's anyone who can give us a few lessons while we're here or we'll just ask some of our friends to help us out but all kitted out all padded out i'm getting hot because i've got so many layers here so our first time and i am pooping myself i'm really excited i'm pooping myself it's quite cloudy today but we are promised like uh, i think it's a bluebird day it's called where it's gonna be super sunny on wednesday today is what day is it today adam sunday Sunday. But yeah, I've got my Holland and Cooper gear on, which I absolutely love. I'll get a proper look of it when we're out. Um, but yeah, today is just all about getting used to it and just trying to understand. I'm so nervous. I've had a look at some of the lips. Oh my god. Everyone got is it recording or is it a picture? It's a video. Uh, what? Oh! oh. Uh, everything's grey apart from like us. I know, I love it. Right, it's so it's easier to find. Yeah. Safety mum of the group. I'm really bright. You're <laughs> so bright. So bright! <laughs> exactly. So would you consider yourself a pro, Charlie? Um, I'm considering uh, going home. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Jen, genuinely. Look at these shallies up at the top. They are so nice. Oh, that one's been this is giving me last like Christmas like slash movie. Hallmark movie vibes. I love it. Little lobster cage, guys. Yeah. <laughs> you don't need to see your phone going to nowhere. No. You be careful on camera, bro. I know, I'm being very risk takery right now. Oh very unlike me. We've just stopped off for some lunch after the most intense morning of my life. Me and Adam have realized we have been humbled by the goddamn slopes. So I've just picked up French onion soup, which looks so fucking good. And did you get a full fat Coke? Yeah, full. Thank God, guys, I need this for energy. I'm dying. So me and Adam have just been humbled real hard on those slopes. We don't really know where we're going, so we ended up in like blue and red slopes and we've had one lesson. No. Okay, so we have just done a pit stop after what can only be described as the most thrown into the deep end experience of my life. Um, so yeah, we've like, me and Adam have just sat down and let uh, the more experienced people we're with just go have fun for a bit just so we can like gather this strength. Nobody tells you how much effort it is lifting yourself off when you've been like falling over and over and over the power you need to lift yourself back up onto your skis and if you fall again you are literally so exhausted guys i'm still here but this time i have a chocolat chill heard great things our friend amy said these are the best they look absolutely epic and i just think this is gonna be good because i couldn't eat earlier because i think i was still a bit anxious so so excited to try this out 
These two are doing snowboarding yeah. within the trip. Uh, Jenny smashed it. Jenny smashed it. First day. She's fucking sick. I do charge quite a bit, but I got a discount. Yeah, he's yeah. premium. He's yeah. premium, bitch, and Jenny's yeah. really paying the price. I think she's gonna have bruises all over her body. Yeah, yeah. obviously. I got my bum pads. Mate, you've done some serious falls. But yeah. squats as well. But it's, it's not knocking your confidence. No, 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 You're really no. so good, unlike me and Adam. Who have had some serious falls and has completely Ooh, knocked our confidence. Have you had a, a, a proper one yet? Like, where it's like, oh, yeah, that might have really hurt you. Yeah, he had a sore wrist situation, yeah, didn't he? No, no, no. I think I scraped my lower back. Ouch. But then it was okay because I wasn't going like too far. Yeah. 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 Y
god and then um he actually took us on a bit of like a baby green blue run which was really nice and then we did try and advance a bit go on a blue run beside parallel ski that was a massive fail but you know what we tried it we attempted it we're not going to ski as long as we did today it was actually quite a nice amount because we've still got energy to like get back we head back to the chalet i'm probably going to have a prosecco because i'm in the mood and yeah take it easy how do you get on with your lesson today? It's good. I feel like I cracked her in a bit. Still falling my ass at times. <laughs> Okay. But, but he said though it's only because you don't lean forward enough. You stand up straight quite a bit. Yeah. And I always say to you, I think it's because you've got naturally quite good posture. So I think you always try and lean up. Instinctively you want to turn on the outside. I know that was me the whole time. It was so hard to... Leaning on the outside. Because you feel like if you're going to lean on the outside, you're going to fall. Yeah. But, oh well, I guess you got to face your fears. How's your skiing day guys been? Now I throw a camera on your face. It's so sunny and the snow is 18 degrees. Yeah, it's um, ridiculous. It's right about snow, I don't understand that. No, I know. I was actually thinking that. Didn't, did science lie to us? Should it not be minus it was, for snow? I think it was like 12 um, down where we were. No, minus goes to ice. Right. So, so you could still have snow without ice? I don't. Well, hold on. Now. I love how we're all in our 30s. We're like, I don't understand the weather. <laughs> 18 degrees, blazing sunshine, absolutely boiling hot. There should not be snow. But it was, it was a good day. Look, Charlie's loving it. it Had his little day. rant, and now he's like, and fun loving it. I loved it. And loving everybody's it. working on their technique. Everybody's yeah. improving. Everybody yeah. fell, except, yeah. me ate the snow. except me. Thank you very much. Too. Okay, do you want to just do a little, um, a little um, speech um, about that? Speech. Okay, how do you feel today, Craig? How do you feel? Do you feel achieved? I feel pretty solid. Machines uh, are in much better shape than yesterday. I feel like they're growing stronger and better with uh, the love and care that I'm giving them. <laughs> the and Ridiculous. I feel like they're ready for you know round three. <laughs> sure. Oh, <bad>. Or <laughs> cake. Round three, bad. <laughs> I really want cake. Um, the, the lemon cake is the for real thing. We got through today. Is it lemon so today? It's it's lemon. the one from yesterday. Yeah, they just yeah. imagine if it did scream. Yeah. They just took ah! in. Day two done, and it was a much better day. We know our way around. We separated off our group in terms of abilities, which I think was a main one. Our instructor was amazing and was really helpful. And now we got our own little cable cart to ourselves, which was really fun. So this is all very new to me and Adam. Like even all of this is like incredible and so new to us. Like the view is incredible. Let me just move this over. Sorry for saying incredible, but it really is. Look at that. Literally feels like being in some kind of adult ski Disneyland. That's exactly how it feels. Adult ski Disneyland vibes. And I just feel very lucky to be here. It is hard work. Don't get me wrong. Skiing is definitely hard work, especially when you're a beginner. But it's really nice. And it's good vibes. And we've had really nice weather. It's just been very hot, hasn't it? Yeah. 12 degrees today. And then up at the top, it was like 15. Look at that. Is that not a winter wonderland? We've had really heavy snow today. What day are we on, hun? Three. Day three. And you can see, maybe, if I try and zoom you in, all the snow over on the trees over there, up in the mountain. Yeah, you can see all of their frosty branches just there. It's amazing. I'm in so much pain today, though, guys. But, hey... We gotta keep it moving, gotta keep it growing. So I've just gotten ready for the day. And we'll be hitting the slope. Hopefully we'll go a bit further up though, so it's not too misty. But yeah, I've got my full bala bala balaclava on today because I just know it's gonna be really cold. I will take something else as well, just in case I get annoyed by this like face restriction going on. I've got my Be Perfect, is it Perfect Moments jacket on and my Holland Cooper cello pets have been wearing the whole time. That is annoying me, what is that? A freckle. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to show you my outfits here, but it's really hard because me and Adam are still just kind of learning to ski and a lot of that is just us falling. So I definitely don't feel safe like taking out my camera or anything. So yeah, but I will try and get a bit more vloggy footage for you today and try and maybe get out some on the ski slopes, depending on how confident I am today. Wow, wow, wow. Isn't that something? Beautiful, isn't it? Love it so much. It is literally like living in a Hallmark movie. I'm obsessed. 
also, I'm getting a sneak peek, Adam, of the cake. So they leave us out cake every day, which is absolutely amazing. <clears throat> this looks like a, oh, this looks like a caramel cake, Adam. Oh my God. You are gonna live your truth. Should I open it up slightly? Yeah, let's have a little look. Wait. Oh my gosh. Tell her about we just stay and eat the cake. <laughs> Yeah, we're really struggling to know what to do today because the snow is so heavy. We don't know whether to keep going to where we've been going and just understanding where the greens are and where we should be or if we want to try something else. Then we're going to try something else today. So I'll keep you posted. The treacherous steps, I swear. We are just walking through the village just now. It is a super sleepy village. There's like no one here. It's so peaceful. And we've got the mountains in the background. But it's cold today. I'm so glad I've got this balaclava. I don't really think it suits me to be honest, but it is so warm. So at this point, I don't really care. It's time to have the ski helmet on and the goggles. I don't even feel like it's snowing, but it's much colder today it's just crazy like it's minus like minus three today i think and yesterday it was like 15 degrees so it literally didn't make any sense but we're walking towards the lobster pods just now which are actually kind of terrifying um it's like you go into these little cages unprotected standing no seat nothing um and they're tiny and you just get taken up the mountain really high it's mental literally look <sighs> just a mouse up in the air I'm trying not to think about it let me show you what you're in now it's coming closer done a couple of rounds I guess you call it down the green slope but it is so hard I think because there's so much snow today the ground is so powdery like the so it's just like powder and the green slope there's not a lot of people on it so it hasn't been like hardened down so I think that's our friends actually so when we slide down it I'm just sludging through snow it's like honestly effort so Adam's going down one more time I can't I'm enjoying the ski lifts that's my favorite part but look how red I am Okay, so we're done skiing today because you'll have seen the footage I just inserted when I was up on the top and you could see nothing but fog. So obviously all I've been screaming all day about is a chocolate show. It's literally all I've been talking about. Um, mine is like half eaten, but this is how it looked at the start. Best four euros in the entire world. I even enjoy the straw. What you've got? What you eating? Hot dog. <laughs> Oh, I was about to say let's have a look, but that's gone. That's gone at that point. And then this is little up from ski place we've got going on. It's really cute. It's just had really heavy snow today, guys. Really, really. Cheers, Cheers guys! Mm -hmm. Sorry, let me give you a moment. Sorry. Um, are you allergic to cashews? Uh, yeah, I can't eat them, but you can eat them in front of me. Perfect. Oh, it just like that. It's gone. Cheers, guys. <laughs> George's like, give me the stomachs. Cheers, guys.
I'm on YouTube film. So today we are going back up the mountain for more skiing. We're going to go to the bit that's a bit easier, a bit more simple. Um, <laughs> for the baby. For the little baby. I just need to learn my basics for a good. Ooh, keep it still? Keep no. it still? Because it, it struggles to focus. Mm -hmm. Um. There we go. Yeah, we went up another route yesterday and it was really difficult. It wasn't the greatest conditions anyway. It was super powdery snow. It was like foggy, couldn't see anything. So we're gonna go to the bit we know and we like just to practice a little bit for an hour. And once we gain a bit of confidence, we can head on to the other side where they are. I'm gonna give Adam all my stuff now. That's the plan. That's the plan, baby. You know what, it's a bit of a walk every day to the ski equipment shop but the walk is beautiful oh adam this is very frosty for these shoes for the trainers like we remember it's on the ground but then we're not like we can't take them with us obviously we're in trainers stupidly in the first look at that is give it another go i feel a bit more confident today because i can actually see like there's no snow mist anywhere i can actually see things it's not foggy it's very icy today but I think that would be better when it was fresh powder and like no one had made any tracks on it. It was very difficult. So I'm actually glad it's blue skies and we're going to go up to the bit that we've done before so it's familiar. So looking forward to it. Heavenly moon, I'm dreaming of somebody soon. Someone will spend a long afternoon close by me. Making me swoon. If you are there, I know a moonlit place we can share. Dancing below such gentle silver beams of the light. What a wonderful night! Banana round two. I actually don't know how many bananas we've had on this trip. How did you find today so far? Good, it was just practicing on that green. Oh, and uh, it was good. No, For the most part, the down the there, I guess. Down, <laughs> down, controlling the trees. Had a really yeah. sharp turn at one point and I've like, uh, <laughs> done something to one of the glutes. <laughs> ripped the glutes. I think he ripped the glute. Uh, so a little bit tender. <laughs> a little bit tender now. Oh, no, just perfect for you to go down a blue with. Absolutely. Love it. Look how cute this is. Okay, thank God I turned. That's so cute. Look at that. Family pick. I love that. Got myself a casual cola. I don't know what it is. I don't even, I never drink full fat cola, but here it's the only thing that is getting me through and giving me the energy I need. Oh my gosh. Guess whose birthday it is? It's the birthday boy. It's the birthday boy. Three, two, three, two. Three two, three two, three two, three two. He's thirty-two, guys. He's thirty-two, and we actually did do a really cute birthday celebration thing this morning. We got up early and we put balloons up, shot glasses, decorations. He's got his own birthday sash, everything. So yeah, how's it feel being thirty-two? And how's it feel being here with all your friends on the slopes? It's good. It's fun. Um, I feel like it's a bit. It could be a bit more dangerous today because I'm older. I'm a bit mm -hmm. more feeble. A bit more fragile. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, Good excuses. Anything could happen. Anything, anything could happen. happen. Anything could happen at this point. I also want to show you my um, ski jacket. I love this one. I haven't worn this one as much because it's white. Um, and I've got it on low. And so I'm like, I don't want to ruin it. But that's the outfit of the day. I think we're going to be doing a little bit of that pre ski today, aren't we? Which will be good. Yes. Got my little mittens from All Saints. And I think. We're even going to attempt to do a couple of blue runs, which is a big upgrade from us. So this is me and Adam's starting point. We actually go on this thing and we take 
the carts up. You can see them just there, up to the beginner slopes. But we are going to attempt to do some blues today. I'm a bit nervous, but I felt confident yesterday, so I'm sure after a little bit, I should be better. And then after that, because Adam's birthday, we're going to go to the Mont Blanc bar as well and get a few drinks, because we haven't actually done that much apres ski, have we? No. We've been very much just trying to focus on not dying. I'm just trying to survive out here. Been hitting it hard and then going back, having dinner and then sleep. Literally, we're so <laughs> exhausted. Maybe a drink in between. Exactly, so, but today, yeah, happy ski do. day for the Papa's birthday. Get a look at this. <laughs> yeah, I know that happened in the shop. Yeah. Shop. We're not going to discuss. We're not going to discuss. Get hit in the head. <laughs> you. I am not at this level yet. It doesn't even look steep, but it's so steep in real life. I promise you. So this is where we will come. Yeah, we'll come out that way and then go straight through. Fine. We'll push ourselves a bit today. Hello. This is me on the babiest of slopes, struggling, trying to ski. But I, I'll show you. Well, Adam's gonna go down first, and he'll film. I'll show you my progress from falling and tumbling. To just about managing to stay up. our first blue run which is really nice there was some, some little bits that were challenging for me but fine just go really slow um, and then most of the way it was nice and straight and you could just cruise I haven't skied for that long in one short time so my back is sore I realize you actually get sore back look how cute the chalet and everything and pretty ski vibes I love it and then all of the trees in the background here it's insane I absolutely love it but we do a second one back to the Mont Blanc bar where we will meet our friends to celebrate Adam's birthday. Also, comedy lol at this. I bet you just feel like you're talking to absolutely no one over here. But Adam's consulting the map to make sure we don't get lost because it's very easy to get lost and you end up on a really hard run that you didn't mean to do. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I want to look professional. Yes. Mm. Thank you. Is that your first birthday beer? Do you have um, Everything's birthday themed. Beer. Mate, you always get a fancy little drink, don't you, Charlie? Yeah, I'm a little I absolutely love that. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. Ooh. Apple spritz for me and Tori. Boop, boop, boop. Cheers, Bob. Cheers. Cheers. Happy birthday. Cheers, everyone. Happy birthday, Adam. Here's to being 32.
this is thirty girls. Judges rule. No, no, yeah. no, I think just I just think try and slide it. Yeah, yeah, and then we're gonna reach your foot. Yeah, because it's because drop it, drop it, kick it. Yeah, judges rules, drop kick. It's never gonna fall. I was just gonna boot that. Yeah, that's kicking it. That's kick. Okay, if you want to do that, Jenny, you can do it that if you want. Or you can do the drop. But I might miss. What have I missed? Exactly. So you've got to be able to You can go into it. I mean, if you, like, because I was going to... Okay, look at it, look at it. I would do it with socks, right? Yeah. You're going to get burned like, in the pool. No, because I'll get it right on the yeah, ground. Okay, you might miss it then. You only got one chance then. Yeah, but if I drop it, that's... If you only have one shot. One shot. One, one shot. one opportunity. No, no, no. <laughs> one shot, one opportunity. Oh my god. Use that leg span. It is Friday morning and the sun is sunning. It's extremely sunny today. Today is our full last day and we are very, very tired now. Um, my body is done, basically. So today we're going to take it nice and easy, do a couple of easy blues, get hot chocolate, that kind of thing. It's another gorgeous day. I actually never understand how it can be this beautiful sunny weather and still have snow. I don't understand. And I know it's colder up in the mountain, but even up in the mountain it's like 10 degrees. So I don't understand. I know for a fact it's warmer here than it is in London, so we'll get a shock when we go back home. But yeah, are you looking forward to just having an easy day today? Yeah. Easy breezy down the slopes. Maybe get a chocolate show. Yeah, I'm really excited about the chocolate show today. I've only had two, and I just feel we need at least at least one today before we leave. Believe me, I wanted to stay. And then you say you've got to go. Wanting to know how you're feeling And then you say I've made a mistake But I got the same And you should've known better than Just me away when I wanted to stay with you Hot chocolate's good? <laughs> Finally got our hot chocolates <laughs> It is very warm <laughs> I'll show you it, but to be honest, it is, mine's uh, is half finished. It is uh, quite warm. Do you feel having the chocolate show? The chocolate show? Yeah, you know, uh, when, uh, when it's warm, uh, but not quite warm. It feels like it. <laughs> it really does. It's so hot. <laughs> also, can everyone say how nice Adam looks with a roll neck? He never wears a roll neck until now, and I've always told him he should. He suits it. So everyone tell him he looks good. <laughs> Also, it's uh, St. Paddy's Day. Happy St. Patrick's Day to all the Irish people out there. And there is an absolute legendary family skiing, dressed as leprechauns, and to be honest, it's everything. Yeah, Adam looks very cool today. I'm really annoying. I don't think it's annoying how guys put absolute zero effort in and they just look cool and girls have to do absolutely everything. It annoys me. But this is such a cool little chalet. I love it. And you can really see the skiers. Let me show you. Just oh there it is, it's turned up. Yeah, Isn't it cool? cool. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Okay, Adam, we're finally at Apri's to get some food and some Cokes, well designed Cokes. How did our cruisy bluesy run go? Well, what happened is we were going down the blue and I said, you know, we need to turn off here or later on. And it was quite steep. So what we decided to do was like go a bit further down. 
Um, and I, it was very unclear if the turn at that point was there because it also joined the steep slope. So I thought I can't be it. So we went further down and then ended up uh, coming round into this bit that seemed quite off piste. And then we kept going along. It's quite flat. It's quite flat, you know. And then we came out to this opening. Uh, and then there was a the lift. And as soon as we saw the lift, I thought, no, we've gone too far down. Uh, so we could either go back on the lift and go up and then take an entire other blue all the way down. All the way down. <laughs> or uh, we decided to walk through the forest. <laughs> Which we had to do. Back onto the blue. In about 20 degrees heat. And because it, it was so low down, it was super icy and slippy. Uh, it's not a vibe. You had a tough time with it. No, mate, absolutely standard. You know me, I had to kick my skis off again and slide on my ass down. Oh, yeah, How embarrassing. That was, that, was that was a bit, yeah. I had to slide on my ass down, humbled by the mountain, as always. But we got it, we made it, and we're gonna have some cooks and fries. Woo! Well done! Send it. Oh, mate, I'll do a high five. You just sent it without me. <laughs> yeah, I made it. Thank you so much. Oh my god, guys. I do not drink full fat coke, but on this holiday, I do. It's a thousand percent needed. Mmm. Honestly. Do I drink full fat coke at home? No. Here, I'm a holiday treat. And also, I feel like we need to get this for the house, Adam. And I know it's extra bougie, but like, this is so cute. Living. Mm. Cheers to sending it and ending it. Bye.